All right, hunters, back here at our honey hole. As the sun sets, we know the deals are about to heat up. Let's head inside and collect them all. Now we know from previous episodes, this has been our honey hole the past couple times we've been here. We're out here again, got new deals to find, scatter the store and see what we can pick up today. Looks like I got something new today. 249 down from 380, tag is fresh for the brother, SE625. Make sure you guys are looking out for this one. Now our first lead for you, something you need to keep an eye on, something we picked up in the past, image skew and UPC right up here. We've grabbed these stroller wagon combos for 56. They should be 50 in this store. Let's head on into the baby section, see if we can locate them. We might need to get that barcode scanned. Uh, we don't know we, if we have sales floor, back room, or they may not even be here. Now, last time we were here, we had these same exact things, although there was a couple car seats that were here as well. We did get this, uh, what, what's the name of it? Harper by Oxford. We did get that scan last time and it is 45. We might take that with us today. Now in here, let's see, let's see. Very similar to this one right here, the stroller wagon combo, baby train. Like I said, we've picked this up in the past. Um, it doesn't look like it's here, nor at the clearance nook over there. We can check around the corner real quick. And then we're gonna go ahead and get that barcode scanned see what their on hand count is now i have been getting a lot of comments how are you knowing about the count we all know that brick seek is broken but there are ways to get around it take your barcode into the store it can be any store it can be a store that's actually showing you that it is at a price point that you want take the barcode find an associate scan the barcode if the barcode says it's here great if it's in the back room great if it's out of stock that's okay because they have a button that they can press check nearby it gives them a certain radius that will show all of the stores that are around the store that you're at that way you can locate the item at the price point that you want and the store that actually has it in stock all right we got that barcode scan and it does say three three on hand three on the sales floor zero in the back room but we are not located on the sales floor now the person that scanned our barcode is going to run back in the back for us we've dealt with him before he's helped us out in the past hopefully he comes out with all three now we already know about the crib for 45 but let's scan the airplane adventure i think last time we checked it it was at the 40 dollars price point let's get our walmart app out make sure you guys are using scan and go on the walmart app it is a paid feature of walmart but you do get a free trial Ooh, ten dollars that's oh that's not good at all they raised it back up from 40 to 99 oh no 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 all right hunters we found an awesome associate like i said i've dealt with him in the past he knows what we need and we need clearance he found all three in the back room and the funny thing is look it's tagged right here with a clearance sticker. All clearance should be on the floor. It should be moved to the floor. Although you already know from watching us and this channel, we find clearance in the back room all the time. All right, now let's make our way into electronics and see if we have any new drops, see if we have any new items to look for. Looks like the laptops that were here before have either moved or they've sold at that $50 price point. I'm pretty sure they've probably sold. Looks like they still have the $5 headphones left over we got a little bit of clearance down there still how about over here yes remember all those 50 dollars laptops they were all right here they have been scooped up and i knew they would be they just weren't at a price point for us to pick up let's go back here and check on these two little end caps no that's all old stuff and this is all old stuff as well with those ten dollar uh routers those are still not going to be at a price point we need. Now let's head out of the electronics section and over into toys. And then we'll head over into sporting goods where our next item on our list is going to be. We've been searching for this for a while now. It is actually one of those bike trailers. It's been at the $69 price point, but we have noticed that it's dropped down to the 30 price point, And that's what we need. Let's check these back end caps. It looks like the Wordle game finally made its way out of here. What do we have right here? 13 down from 55. Oh, this is an active gift set. Never seen that before. Still got 35 on the Rainbow High car. Now we've got a few new things up here. This Paw Patrol truck storage case and this dump truck by Wheelers. We've already seen these. These have been marked down to five. What else do we have down here? We saw those last time. 
Let's check this one and the uh, truck storage case, see what we got. What do we got on the wheeler? Seven bucks. No, we're gonna wait. In the truck storage case, what do we have on this one? That one's 19, definitely gonna wait. Let's check on this little end cap, more of the dump truck. Still have this slime tube for five. Those we know are full price. Now, we're over here. We need to locate the child carrier, the blue one. We have red, we have green, which we are going to scan every single one of these, and we have orange, and then there's also a blue one. We got the barcode scanned, and it does say one on hand, one in the sales floor. We do have someone running in the back room to check for us real quick, but while we're waiting, we're gonna scan the rest of these. Some of these will be replacing the old ones. That one's 149. How about the red one? That one's 119. How about the orange one? I think we've noticed the orange one is kind of kept up with the blue one, but it doesn't appear that way at this store at 149. Now we're gonna check in here. We didn't see anything new last time, but you never know. They may have put some new stuff out for us. Doesn't look like it today. Now while we're waiting, we are going to come in here and check these little end caps over here. See if they've put anything new out. See if they've dropped the price on some of the stuff that we were interested in last time. Looks like they still have the ice pop molds, which is okay. Looks like they've got twin sheets over there and we only have two Roombas left. Two Roombas left, none of the comforter sets let's scan the Roombas and see if they've changed at all now we've got two different ones we've got an i1 and a 676 the 676 was 100 and this one is also 100 i do not like this box but we'll scan them see what we got on them we were hoping that they were going to take that 50 dollars price point but i think they're going to hold strong on the 100 as they seem to be clearing them out as time goes on, let's check the I-1. Yes, both of them are also at the 100. Now with that being said, let's keep moving down through here. Uh, we can check, looks like they have some towels. We don't need any of those. What's this over here? Oh, more of the sandwich makers and a table lamp for 20 down from 80. These were here last time, lamp shades, sheet sets. Check around the corner. Still have the instant vortex and anything else new? What's this? Uh, Vegeta sheet slicer, 13 down from 21. Just wanna scan it. I know the box is messed up. It's definitely got to go locally, but I have a feeling that the price point is still not going to be there. Yep, still 50. Now we wanna cruise in here and check on these coolers because we do have still quite a few up here. Last time we checked, they were 30. Are they still 30 or did we finally get a $20 bill on them? No, they're still 30. Now let's run back to the hunting section, see what we got in there. Oh, and you know what we should do? We should also check on our splatter balls that they weren't able to grab last time we were here. Ceiling fans for 25. Utility lights for 28. Let's check these clearance caps, see what we got. I think we scanned these beds last time they were 25. Yep, still 25. Good personal price point at that, especially for a queen. Now let's check in here. We should check on these. They were 25 last time, down from what? 38, still 25 for the 32 pound set. Now we also know that we have some more air mattresses up top so when they do finally hit that rock bottom low price that we need hopefully those are still up there still got the winter gloves not really digging those a dollar for these compression shorts and shirts very good deal anything over here oh this um heated insole these should definitely be on clearance down from 129 to 99 They've been even cheaper elsewhere. Now these baseball backpacks, the pink ones were five last time. We don't need them, but it's a great deal down from 20. Check this Fit RX Mini Pro, cause the tag says 10 bucks right here. I don't know what this would have originally been, but 10 bucks is definitely not it. That is definitely a clearance price. Let's scan it and see if it is 10. It is 10. Now let's do some research on it. If anything, this would be a great personal buy or even a local flip you might even be able to do 20 bucks but we need to know what the msrp is before we do anything on it look right over there we have some fishing rods that are kind of hanging out what are you doing over there are you on clearance and you're kind of just hiding you can scan this one right here no they're not on clearance we've picked that up on clearance for 15 in the past and look someone's hiding this uh vest back here as well the heated vest 130 oh look it's down to 40. Now as it's going into springtime 
I'm probably not going to pick this up at the $40 price point, but if that hits 20, we will definitely pick it up. Back here in the coolers to double check we're not missing anything. Make sure they didn't bring anything out from the back. I'm not seeing it. Now let's go check back in with our guy and see if he was able to locate that one bike trailer. Now I think we're going to get this Oxford Baby Harper 4-in-1 crib at that $45 price point. That's a really good deal, especially for a 4-in-1. Now, if it was just a regular old crib, then we might have to wait for another drop. But we've done well with cribs in the past, and this is a good crib for you to keep your eyes out on. All right, hunters, now we were looking for the blue version of this, but unfortunately, they were not able to locate it. That's all right. We still know a lot of stores that have it at the $69 price point. We just need to keep checking back in, and hopefully, we'll get that $50 to $30 drop. Now, as for those splatter balls, we do know they were up on top sock, wrapped with some other uh, shelving units and stuff like that. We did speak with the coach and the manager, and they did say they are not pulling those down until after the reset has begun. So we've got another week to wait. We'll come back and check back in on them. Hopefully they put them out on the sales floor for us to grab. If you guys enjoyed this episode, please on your way out, go ahead and smash the like button, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already done so. Make sure you hit the bell notification to stay up to date on all the latest and greatest episodes. Guys, and remember, always keep up the hunt.